The Fire TV stick is probably the most banned from the book streaming device out there. Since it's so cheap, you might have bought more than one. The only trouble is, you now got to set it up and install all your third party APKs. And doing that on one stick can be fine, but if you have five Fire TV sticks, it could take some time, especially if you're repeatedly downloading, downloader, downloading a custom APK store, and then you go finding the best APKs. We're gonna take that hassle away, and now what we're gonna do today is we're gonna install our favorite applications onto one of our devices. And then we're gonna take those applications, copy them to the USB stick, look the USB stick into one of our other devices and then we can install all our favorite applications just from this USB stick folks which will be very much faster folks so if you're ready to learn let's get started <laughs> So what you need to have guys is a USB port on your Fire TV device. Now if you have the third send Fire Cube great you can just plug in your USB device directly into the Fire TV Cube. But if you have an older Fire Cube or a Fire TV stick you're not gonna have a USB port so what you'll have to do is order an OTC and the very cheap to buy guys the last time I checked um, the range from about seven to six pounds so once you got one doesn't matter if it's a USB 3 or a 2 is we're gonna Look at our USB stick. It just need to be formatted to FAT32, guys. So make sure you do not fire a computer. So all we're gonna do, look that into the USB A bit. And if we have a TV stick like this, we can just look the OTC into the bottom of it just like that and then for our fire stick cable we can just plug it into the USB-C but otherwise if we have an older fire TV cube for example what we'll need to do again get yourself an OTC and then we're gonna plug our USB stick in we're gonna leave the USB-C port plunk since the older Fire TV cube has a different type of connection from the power and we're just gonna shove in the OTC into this small USB-C port so let's just do that. Just nine And then we're all set. We can power this up and start installing our favorite applications. Okay guys, so we've looked in our device and to verify if the Fire TV is reading our device, all we've got to do is going to our settings, plus down 
to my fire tv and then down here the subtle usb drive if you do not you haven't formatted it correctly just go on and go on your computer and format the drive to fat 32 like I mentioned earlier right so once we're verified if our fire tv is reading our usb safe the next thing we need to do is install our favorite apk onto this device so let's do that so we're gonna go to settings down to my fire tv now if it's the first time doing this you won't see the developer options click on about and where it says your fire tv model mine says fire tv cube so push the middle button on the remote control seven times till it says you no need your now developer push back You'll see the developer options. In here, we're gonna turn on ADB debugging and insight install unknown apps. Make sure that is on for downloader. Then press the home button. So we're gonna open up downloader. If you haven't got it already, so we shall search the Amazon App Store for downloader, you'll find it there and you can download it for free. Once you're in downloader, you can download whatever you like. So if you want to skip this portion of the video to where we copy the apps to the USB wife, here's the timestamp here. Otherwise, stick with me. I'm gonna go to my APK store and the number code for that is A26476. We're gonna press and go. And this app store is totally free to use, guys. All I ask in return this for you to hit that subscribe button so i'm just gonna download a few apps so let's say i want an apk store like app toy tv i'll just click on this and then install it We need to donate this APK file because it's taken up memory on our device. So push to the need to confirm, push the need again. Let's say I want, I don't know, let's say I want a file monitor. So exp no for instance. Again, we do not need that APK file. So push the need, the need again to confirm. Let's say I want media player on my fire devices. And so let's the name this final APK file. And that's it. I've installed all of my apps that I want. So an app store, a file manager, a media player and an answer the question is how do we copy these apks over to our usb stick so now we can access them on other devices very simple folks all we need to do is to install a file manager now i've already got a file manager here exp no and you can also i believe get it from the amazon app store so let's type it in 
Yep, you got it from the Amazon App Store for free. So once you got that, click on open. It would say, and now explore to access photos, media, and files on this device. Make sure it now is highlighted, press the middle button, and then you're here, folks. So what we want to do, guys, is we want to navigate on the left hand pane, folks. Once we're here, we're going to go down to App Manager. Click on App Manager, and on the App Manager, you'll see Installed. Click on Installed, and then you'll see all your APKs here. So I want to install Wolf Launcher. So if we non hold on one, we go up to Mark Files and we can put ticks to which APKs we want to copy to the USB safe. So I want to copy Aptoy TV, MXP. Now yeah, Wolf Nonza and Exp no File Manager. YouTube would be a better one, but anyways. So once we've ticked our APKs, we're gonna go up to copy just the click on copy and now we'll copy to the USB wife. As long as we have it highlighted in this menu here. So if we got it highlighted. And it will say do you want to allow access to this wife. So just click allow. And then. In there if we go to copy. And say okay. It will now copy to our USB drive so now we are folks so as you can see the APKs are copied to the USB drive then what we can do is exit out of the file manager and then plug our OTC cable out of our device and take it to another device so now we can install our APKs okay so we're on our other device so we're gonna install the exp no file monitor so now we can access our USB drive and to verify if our USB drive is being read Going on to settings, my fire TV, and as none as USB wife's there, we're all good to go. We're gonna install exp no now, so go to find, and then search. In here, we're gonna type in exp no, just so like that. We're gonna download it. We're gonna click on the home button. We're gonna go to our settings. Down to My Fire TV. To find the pet options, if you do not see it, tap on About and tap whatever model you have seven times till it says no need your OED Defender Pet. Push back. You'll see them go into install unknown apps and make sure exp no is on. Press home and then we're gonna open up exp no. Click on and now and then it should read our USB wife. So we can go into it, click on and now, and that's it.
These are all of our APKs, so we can install them out. So if I wanted to install app toys, click on it, click on install, done, go down to MX, click on install, And then now we'll download the MX player. Wolf. We'll install it. Done. And then that's the YouTube. Install and that download YouTube. So if you now press the home button, as you can see, YouTube's there, which must mean all of our other APKs are on there. So I hoped you liked this video, and if you did, give it a big thumbs up. Subscribe to my channel if. You're new, and that's always, guys. Have a great day, and I'll see you in my next video.